You Henderson police swearing in their new chief today, Holly Chadwick. 8 News Now reporter Victoria Saha in Henderson tonight with what members of the department are saying about their new boss. Chief Holly Chadwick being sworn in, surrounded by members of the Henderson Police Department. Many have been working alongside her for 21 years. Some of you were with me at the academy graduation, and now you're here with me today. Chief Chadwick, no stranger to the turbulence the department has faced in recent years. Not one, but two police chiefs leaving abruptly. Chief Chadwick not going into much detail about what led her to take the new role, but she made sure to thank her supporters. You know I will get this done the right way. We are so grateful for our community. Every day when we come to work, that is our sole focus, is to protect and serve this community. Back in November, two police unions voted no confidence in previous Chief Thedrick Andres. He retired in February. Lieutenant Chris Agger, president of Henderson Police Supervisors Association, is looking forward to seeing the new chief in action. She's a, a big proponent of communication between everyone so everybody knows where they're all at. Lieutenant Agger tells me when he was a sergeant, Chief Chadwick was his captain, so he knows what kind of a leader she is. If we had an officer injured or in the middle of the night, 2 a.m., she wants the phone call. She wants to know what's going on. She wants to know that we're taking care of the officer. Yeah, and you're very confident that those qualities will follow her to the chief's chair? Absolutely, and I know, I think the good thing about that is that she will lay out those expectations for the people that work below her as deputy chiefs and captains, uh, that she would expect the same thing from them. As you heard in that story there, this is the third chief for the Henderson Police Department since 2017. Now, before Thedrick Andres, Letitia Watson was in charge, but she was let go in 2019, and there are still legal proceedings between the city and Watson.